In the quiet corners of our minds, a voice whispers doubts. Am I enough? Do I deserve happiness? We carry the weight of past hurts, of missed opportunities, of dreams deferred. It's a heavy burden, one that can dim our spirits and cloud our vision. But today, we're here to tell you that a brighter path exists, a path where self-love isn't a distant dream, but a tangible reality, a path where letting go of the past paves the way for a future filled with joy, peace, and unwavering self-worth. The secret to unlocking a life of authentic self-love lies in the simple yet profound act of letting go. It's about releasing the grip of past regrets, the sting of old wounds, and the fear of what might have been. It's about understanding that we are not defined by our experiences, but rather by our resilience and our capacity to grow. Letting go isn't about forgetting or denying the past. It's about acknowledging what happened, learning from it, and then choosing to move forward. It's about freeing ourselves from the chains of negativity that keep us tethered to the past, preventing us from fully experiencing the present moment. When we hold on to anger, resentment, or guilt, we give them power over our lives. We allow them to shape our thoughts, our actions, and our relationships. But when we choose to let go, we reclaim that power. We open ourselves up to the possibility of healing, growth, and true self-love. Imagine a hot air balloon weighed down by sandbags. Each sandbag represents a past hurt, a limiting belief, or a negative emotion. As long as those sandbags remain, the balloon cannot rise. But one by one, as we release those sandbags, the balloon becomes lighter. It begins to ascend, offering a new perspective, a wider view, a sense of freedom. Letting go is like releasing those sandbags. It allows us to rise above the negativity, to see the world with fresh eyes, to accept our true potential. It's a process of liberation, of shedding the weight that has been holding us back for far too long. It's important to understand that letting go is not a one-time event. It's a continuous practice, a conscious choice we make each day. There will be moments when the past tries to creep back in, when old wounds resurface, when doubts resound. But in those moments, we have the power to choose. We can choose to dwell in the darkness or to step into the light. Letting go is not about being perfect, it's about being human. It's about acknowledging our flaws and imperfections while still recognizing our inherent worth. It's about understanding that we are all works in progress, constantly evolving and learning. It's about giving ourselves permission to be who we are without judgment or comparison. It's about accepting our past, accepting our present, and creating a future that is filled with love, joy, and authenticity. So how do we begin this journey of letting go? It starts with a simple decision, a decision to no longer be defined by our past. A decision to forgive ourselves and others. A decision to release the negativity and accept the possibilities. It may not always be easy. There will be challenges along the way. But with each step, with each release, we become lighter, freer, more aligned with our true selves. We begin to experience the transforming power of self-love. Letting go is the key that unlocks the door to a life of self-acceptance, inner peace, and boundless joy. It's the bridge that connects us to our authentic selves, to the love that resides within each and every one of us. It's time to release the past, accept the present, and step into the light of self-love. Now, you might be thinking, letting go sounds great, but is it really that simple? The truth is, self-love isn't about mastering complex techniques or following rigid rules. It's about cultivating a deep and unwavering connection with yourself. It's about recognizing your worth, honoring your needs, and setting healthy boundaries. While the concept of self-love may seem straightforward, the journey itself requires commitment and dedication. It's about making conscious choices every day that align with your values and priorities. It's about prioritizing your well-being, even when it feels challenging or uncomfortable. 
It's about showing up for yourself even when you feel like giving up. Self-love isn't a destination. It's an ongoing process. It's about continuously learning, growing, and evolving. It's about accepting your imperfections and celebrating your strengths. It's about treating yourself with the same kindness and compassion you would extend to a loved one. We all carry emotional baggage from our past experiences. These unresolved emotions, whether they stem from childhood traumas, failed relationships, or personal setbacks, can weigh us down and prevent us from moving forward. And They can create a sense of heaviness, anxiety, and even depression. Letting go of this emotional baggage is a powerful act of self-liberation. It allows us to break free from the chains of the past and step into a future filled with possibilities. When we release the pain, anger, and resentment that we've been holding on to, we create space for joy, peace, and inner healing. The freedom that comes with letting go is immeasurable. It's like shedding a heavy coat on a warm day or breathing fresh air after being confined to a stuffy room. It's a sense of lightness, clarity, and renewed energy. When we release the emotional baggage, we no longer allow it to control our thoughts and actions. We become more present, more grounded, and more capable of making choices that align with our true selves. We open ourselves up to new experiences, new relationships, and new opportunities. Nurturing self-love is a journey of self-discovery and acceptance. It begins with cultivating self-compassion, that gentle understanding towards ourselves when we stumble or fall short. Instead of berating yourself for mistakes, treat yourself with the same kindness you would offer a friend. Recognize that everyone makes mistakes and it's through these experiences that we learn and grow. Practice self-acceptance by acknowledging your strengths and weaknesses without judgment. Accept your unique qualities, quirks, and imperfections. You are a whole and complete individual, worthy of love and respect, just as you are. Prioritize self-care by setting aside time each day to nourish your mind, body, and soul. This could involve engaging in activities that bring you joy, spending time in nature, practicing mindfulness or meditation, or simply taking a few moments to breathe deeply and relax. Set healthy boundaries by learning to say no to things that drain your energy or compromise your well-being. It's okay to prioritize your own needs and make choices that honor your values and priorities. Cultivate a positive mindset by focusing on gratitude and abundance. Celebrate your accomplishments no matter how small and express appreciation for the good things in your life. A grateful heart attracts more blessings. Past experiences, particularly those that have caused pain or trauma, can leave deep scars on our hearts. These wounds can affect our self-esteem, our relationships, and our overall well-being. Healing from these past hurts requires courage, compassion, and a willingness to forgive. Forgiveness doesn't mean condoning the actions of others or forgetting the pain they caused. It means releasing the resentment and anger that keep you tethered to the past. It's about acknowledging the hurt, allowing yourself to feel the emotions, and then choosing to let go. Forgiveness is a gift you give to yourself. It frees you from the burden of carrying the past and allows you to move forward with a lighter heart. It opens the door to healing, growth, and deeper self-love. Healing takes time. Be patient with yourself and don't be afraid to seek support from loved ones or professionals if needed. Surround yourself with positive influences and engage in activities that promote emotional well-being. As you heal and grow, you'll discover a newfound sense of inner peace and resilience. Self-doubt can be a persistent companion, whispering insecurities and undermining your confidence. But true self-worth is not about external validation or comparing yourself to others. It's about recognizing your inherent value, your unique gifts, and your capacity for growth. 
One strategy for overcoming self-doubt is to challenge negative self-talk. When you find yourself dwelling on self-criticism, replace those thoughts with positive affirmations. Remind yourself of your strengths, your accomplishments, and the qualities that make you special. Another powerful approach is to focus on self-improvement. Set realistic goals and take small steps each day towards achieving them. As you advance, your sense of self-efficacy will grow and you'll become more confident in your skills. Surround yourself with positive influences and supportive people who uplift and encourage you. Limit your exposure to negativity and those who bring you down. You deserve to be surrounded by people who believe in you and celebrate your successes. Practice gratitude by acknowledging the good things in your life. Appreciate your health, your loved ones, your opportunities, and the simple joys that each day brings. Gratitude fosters a positive mindset and helps you focus on abundance rather than lack. Self-love is not a selfish act. It's a catalyst for positive change in all areas of your life. When you love and respect yourself, you set the standard for how others treat you. You attract healthier relationships, create more fulfilling experiences, and radiate a sense of confidence and well-being. In your relationships, self-love enables you to set healthy boundaries, communicate your needs effectively, and attract partners who value and respect you. You'll no longer settle for less than you deserve or tolerate disrespect. Instead, you'll cultivate connections built on mutual love, trust, and support. In your career, self-love empowers you to pursue your passions and make choices that align with your values. You'll be more likely to take risks, accept challenges, and pursue opportunities for growth. You'll approach your work with confidence and enthusiasm, knowing that you have the skills and abilities to succeed. Overall, self-love enhances your well-being by reducing stress, anxiety, and depression. You'll develop a greater sense of inner peace, resilience, and joy. You'll feel more connected to yourself, to others, and to the world around you. And so the journey begins, a journey of self-discovery, of healing, of growth. It's a journey that starts with a single step, a single choice to prioritize your well-being, to honor your worth, to love yourself unconditionally. It may not always be easy. There will be setbacks and challenges along the way. But with each step, with each act of self-compassion and acceptance, you'll move closer to a life filled with joy, peace, and authentic self-love. You are not alone on this journey. There are countless others who have walked this path before you, and there are many who will walk beside you. Most importantly, never give up on yourself. You are worthy of love, happiness, and success. Believe in your potential, trust in your resilience, and keep moving forward one step at a time. The future is yours to create, a future where you shine brightly, where you love yourself deeply, and where you live a life that is true to your heart. So take a deep breath, open your heart, and step onto the path of self-love. The journey awaits, and the possibilities are endless. As you step onto this path of self-love, know that your experiences and insights are valuable. Share your stories, your challenges, and your triumphs with others. By connecting and supporting each other, we create a ripple effect of positivity and growth. If this message has resonated with you, please show your support by liking this video and subscribing to the channel for more inspiring content. Together, let's create a world where self-love is not just a concept, but a way of life.